news of fire spreads like flames in a small town. Spring sure. Valley has been Joy McCoy's home for 27 years. Many memories from this old house. My uh, daughter, I used to live next door. She learned to ride her bicycle in the backyard and all that kind of stuff. It's a beautiful home. Beautiful but difficult for firefighters to enter. There were so many materials in their way in the front of the house, and there were two pit bulls in the backyard. Chief Moeller says two dogs inside did not make it out. Time they tried to get in the backyard, uh, the pit bulls wouldn't let them in the backyard, so we had a hard time making entry there until we got the dogs detained in the backyard. The dogs also forced Dayton Power and Light to cut power to more than just the one house. At one time, the post office was dark. Across the street, the library. So they're, they're classic. We hate to see them, see them go. Neighbors like Mike Harris hope the fire won't stop renovations here. But it can't help but think of the eyesore it might become. This is what disappointment looks like in a village of hundreds. When something happens to one of us, it happens to all of us. We feel for each other. We try to take care of each other. And this is a real tragedy. Pam Elliott, 2 News.